Hey, you okay? Hi. Yeah. Okay. My name is Officer Craddock. You seem to have gotten into an accident. Okay. Do you know what's going on? Yes. You know where you're at? Yes. Okay, where are you at? Um, by my home. Where's your home at? Okay, you, it's, I don't, it's, I see Uber, but I don't want to see exactly where it's supposed to be at. You know, Take my car. What was that? Take my car. Your card? Yeah, no, just so, you know. <clears throat> so where exactly do you live at? Um, two streets over. Hold on. Are you the councilwoman? I am a council president. Oh, you're the council president? Yeah. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. How'd you end up on the grass here? You just missed the turn? Because look, okay. I'll, be, I'll be honest with you, right? Sorry. Right? If, if something's wrong, I think you should get checked out. Okay. okay. Even if you think that something might be wrong, you're so not feeling well. So, will you guys take me? Well, they could take you. Yeah, we could take you up to the hospital. Yeah. But you said you didn't want to go with us. You think you should? Yeah. In the process. Open line at 439, but it's in. Sounds like a party in the background. No, it's all. Oh, right. Oh, if I give you four quarters, I'm going to That's actually impressive. But LT is coming out here. Well, does he know who she is? Yeah, everybody knows. What were you going to say? I was going to say, it's actually impressive to crash your car that big going uphill. I'll take it. I see. Hey, Suzanne. What? So, look, I know you kind of explained it to me before, but before you leave, I need to know exactly what happened. Um, I was coming home, Sorry, and Sorry, then baby. I saw there was, like, a thing that ran across the street, and there, and then I just, like, far escaped. What, what ran across the street? It looked like, um, like, maybe, a. Uh, I think some kind of animal. Okay, and then where were you coming from today? Are you in the Um, just, uh, dinner. Dinner, where at? Christian. It was dinner, and... Uh, why? I just, I gotta know from the report. Hey, you're on a mother. What, what's, what's presenting? I mean, you, you said you're presenting a certain way. What do you mean? Yeah, it is what it is. I mean, it just smells like that. She was very confused. She didn't seem oriented. She okay. couldn't tell me where she was at. We've decided that we are going to the hospital. Okay. So I don't know if you guys want to go talk to her what's going on with this. But. All right, Mr. Lovick, you're going to go get checked out? Yeah? Okay. Right. As far as I'm aware, there aren't any more double checking sites. Right? We're going to come talk to you at the hospital then, all right? Okay. Thank you. Are you going to Robert Wood or St. Peter's? Now that thing in the windshield that says city new is this a city car or is this her personal car? No, this is her personal car. That's basically what that is is a placard for her where she parks in the city. Okay, because I was trying to figure out. I'm like, yeah, is this because the car like, the register? So yeah, so you see how it says city the reservoir official, official business. business. Yeah. yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Just doing four four fifty the way you normally do, and you know if you got to get the blood drawn and everything else, then it is what it is. Huh? Yeah. I know that I hit a tree, right? Yeah. I'm not trying to get away from that. Please make sure that I'm taking care of you. We're going to request the blood draw, okay. and then we'll be out of your hair. And then okay. you just have to wait for the doctor. Okay, the nurse is Are you guys here. all good new friends of people? Yeah, no. of course. Yeah. You, you want to take it back. You do not want to consent to the blood draw. I clarify and I will call an attorney and I... And well, we're beyond... No, so the attorney, you, you can have an attorney. We're not asking you any question about the incident. So, you can I, get an attorney. Trust me, I understand. I am an attorney. I would like to call my family in case I'm dying. You're not dying. I can, I can promise you you're not dying. Okay. You're, you're, okay, you're well, yeah, I would like to call the prosecutor's office. So, you want to consent? We'll just do the form real quick, which you already did, and then we'll have the blood draw taken. If you don't want to consent, 
then we're gonna wait and you have to get your phone call afterwards. And then I would like to call okay. my Hold way on. on all the Suzanne. old people. Suzanne. This is this is protecting your neck and your head to make sure that there's no injury. So you have to stop. All I wanted to do was go home. You know that. You can't go home because you crashed your car. I know. And then you said, and you were drinking alcohol when you crashed your car. Yeah. Yeah. So that. So now that's why they're here because you're in their custody. I know. I know. I don't need all this. Okay. In regards to right now, we're doing the blood draw and it's going to get done. So and uh, so the judge through the Democratic organization already said that they are allowing I don't know what his political affiliation is, but yes, he's approved a search warrant for the blood. <laughs> oh my god. There's a warrant against me. All the crimes that go on in New Brunswick, there's a warrant against me. Lay down. No, just say... Let me see if I can. No, all you gotta do is say, sign, career done, council on done, get this off of my life. Let everything done. So, if I go out and get all of these homeless on the streets, the drunks, and bring them in, you'll just keep them here? I would like a car home. I'm telling you that now. I need to take care of my dogs on medication. No, I need that now. And if not, and if not, then I am telling you that I'm going to hold you liable for what happens to my pets. Sure. That's your prerogative. And I am also an attorney, and I I find this ridiculous. And I would like to call the attorney from the city also to come down here right now and take care of this issue with me. Thanks guys, I'm sorry for wasting your time. I wish you had better things you could take care of too. But I am very, I, I'm a big criminal. I to ask my LEOs, can you give me a ride home? We can arrange for a free ride home. We'll get you a lift. Can you yeah, give they, me a ride they, home they, now? I'm asking for you. you right now. Can I give you a ride home now? No. What? Because you're not cleared from the hospital, so we're not giving you a ride home. And, and just for the record, I always support my police department. I appreciate it. Thank you. But apparently, it doesn't matter. Just when you get back, it's awesome. All I'm asking um, for is a ride home. Just, and, I definitely need you to make sure you send someone over and take care of my dogs.